Welcome to my channel. I'm Zhang Jingxu. Let's look at the problem 43 in chapter 10. In this chapter, we talk about rotational motion. And in this problem, you can see in this model, the first quantity given is the function, the tension, this force with the variable t, this one, right? The second one is given is the renders for this pulley, r. And also, what is next? The next given is uh, we can look at the example 10, 9 on your test book. It, in this example, find the i momentum of a ratio for this pulley. So this quantity is given. And ask you to find the leader speed at the time t equal to 8 seconds. So the leader speed, the leader velocity for this pulley equal to omega times r, right? So how can we connect them together? It looks like if we can find the angular velocity at t equal to 8, and then we can find the linear speed at the time t equal to 8, right? Looks like we need to find omega at the t equal to 8 at first. Now, how can we connect all these quantities together? Look at there, this one. We know the torque can equal to the r radius times the force, right? So this is the right angle. So Ft times r, the torque, and it can also equal to i times alpha, right? Momentum of a ratio times the angular acceleration, agree? Now we look at this equation. So we can write the alpha equal to r times Ft divided by i, no problem. And then this alpha, if we can be the duration of the angular velocity with time t. Now we have this function, agree? Now in this function, we input the ft inside. See, we get this function. This function is very important. Why? Because we can do the integral at both sides. Find the function omega with t. There we do the function, we do the integral with the omega from the zero to omega and t from zero to t. And then we get this function. For this function, it's the uh, omega with t. And this one, we know the sp linear speed equal to omega times r. So we just uh, times r. Now it's done. We get the linear speed of function with time t. You just input t equal to 8. You get the final answer, 17 meter per second. Thank you.